What's good, YouTube family? It's your boy Earl. Welcome back to my channel. It's Real Life with Earl. I'm making this vlog right now just to give y'all an update of what I've been going through and, you know, just give you an update on my life and how things been going and what I've been up to recently. And for those who just now getting into the channel, I'm gonna give y'all a little background story on who I am. Get y'all caught up so y'all won't feel like, oh, well, I don't really know this guy. So let's get into it. My name is Earl. I originally am from Virginia. I recently graduated in 2022 from North, the illustrious North Carolina a and at McCride. You already know the vibes. After that, uh, graduated in 2022, job offer out here in Denver, Colorado. Recently just finished up a year. I will just give y'all the whole, you know, mini, short, not really a long story. Just give y'all an update on how it's been out here so far. So it's been pretty good, you know. Um, got a lot of interesting you know, adventures out here. Like it's been very, you know, a learning experience, I can say, of, uh, understanding the culture out there. Even though I know a lot of people say Colorado doesn't really have a culture. It's, I mean, it's, it's a little something. It's not like really, really culture, but it's, it's pretty cool. Um, I say like food-wise, mainly like a brewery, burger, spot, bison. Not really a lot of food out here. Like maybe like in the springs, they have a certain little bit more food and stuff like that. But it's, it's, it's fairly decent. They have a lot of food chain restaurants and all that. But I mean, it, it's whatever you make the most of it, you know what I'm saying? Weather-wise, weather, weather out here, it's dry heat, can't complain, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's as hot as hot, it's cold as cold. I'm, you know, from the south area, dealing with humidity and things of that nature. Dealing with dry heat, like 90 degrees here is nice compared to 90 degrees back at, back at home is, is, is different. So I definitely can't complain on that. Experience out here that I dealt with, uh, done a lot of things like especially recently this summer uh been out you know traveling around colorado got like the same rooms uh i'll definitely post a video of that me and my boy tell you we did that like a, maybe like a month or so ago uh, kind of also uh did a manager and climb you know climb like the tallest tallest and climb it's crazy like, i think it's like if they said it's like taller than the entire state or something like that but it was pretty tall I got a video for that with uh, me and my boy with Tay and Trey. Like that was that was a definitely great experience. Um, I also did like white water raft and had a great experience with uh, some of my friends doing that as well. I feel like overall, if you're not going to see yourself living out anywhere permanently, you always got to experience as much as you can watch this. My experience so far in Colorado has been pretty well, but I feel like you know, you got this fast boat, went to a rock and Avalanche, and I still want to go to a uh, Broncos game. Hopefully, those vlogs will come up soon. Even though it's not really a lot of black people out here, I know people like in Colorado, you know, it's somewhere a place you go visit, like go to the mountains, go to Aspen, go to Vail, and things of that nature. Yeah, for sure. Definitely agree with that. Like, if I didn't have a job out here, that'd be the only reason why I'd be out here for real, too. I mean, but it's cool overall wise. I feel like it has a certain niche. Out here, you know, it's something a little different, you know what I'm saying? Like, we can say this to wake up to the mouth every day. And also, the friends that I've been out here yeah, definitely hate help make it more easier for me to settle. Being by yourself is cool. I mean, but some people can be by themselves. I feel like, you know, if you had a right group around you, I feel like you can really make, you know, the vibe a little bit better. The friends that I've made so far for this year, like, have really helped me have a better settling and, and, and chill moment of being. So, far, so I can't complain on that. Also, I'd like to uh, thank one of my uh, aunts out here that helped me. Uh, one of my mom's college friends that helped me settle in. Because, like, if I didn't have her out here, I would not be out here. My company only gave me so so much money for me really to be out here. Because if I didn't really get a good enough, you know, place of settling with somebody that I knew out here to help me, you know, get myself implemented into the, you know, state and the city and things like that. I don't even think I'll be able to make it out here by myself. Whenever you're moving, anybody that's moving, make sure that you research and make sure you have affordability before you can make a step like this. Cause you know what I mean? I already knew off the money, relocation money alone, I would have never had the money to get views on my own. But that being said, I Shout out to Susie for like helping me get on my feet. I really appreciate that. Overall, like I said, with uh, Colorado, it's been pretty smooth. Like close down, down, 
Denver. I've been downtown a couple of times. Well, I just hate, I hate, I hate, I hate parallel parking. I know people gonna be like, well, you mean you don't need to be in New York? Yeah, that's fine too. I just, I just hate parallel parking. That's just me. It just get annoying, especially people on your tail and things like that. It's just like downtown. I'm cool with downtown, but I just hate parallel parking. That's not, that's not my vibe. That's not what I'm gonna do. Other than that, like downtown, like I said, it's, it's, it's a little vibe. It's not like it's crazy. I'm not saying it's ATL, Miami, Houston, Dallas, uh, New York, LA. I'm not saying it's like that, but it, it has its moments. Like we have a good time. Like I said, it really depends on the friends that you have out here. You, whatever you make the most of it. I would say, I can, I can say for me personally, I don't see myself coming. want to live out here, but... I feel like I still have some things I definitely want to get off, like the bucket list of like places I still haven't gone to, like the Red Rock. Maybe I'll have like a cabin trip vlog to show y'all like you know, snowing and skiing. I don't know about asking a bit. I don't know if I got money like that. Cause I'm a software engineer, it don't mean no about cost of living out here, people. I'm gonna I'm I'm tell y'all on the next video about that. It's just, it's just the cost of living out in Colorado is no joke. <laughs> Low key getting up to Cali, I ain't even gonna hold you, bro. Like, the cost of living out in Colorado is no joke. It's just kinda tight. Like, everybody, like, well, your apartment, I know y'all gonna look in the background, like, your apartment looking alright, but you look like you got a little, little something. Yeah, I, I get you. I get you, but <laughs> it's not sweet over here, I promise you. Barely scraping it is me, but I, I, you know, I'm making it do, you know, I'm blessed. You know, it's been a blessing being out here, you know, experiencing things. I know a lot of people, like I'm a people person, but I like to pick up on vibes and, you know, get, get well acquainted with a lot of people, you know. Yeah, man, I've just been vibing, traveling, experiencing new things, trying whatever I can while I'm in Colorado, uh, other than working. Like, really been working, like, 24-7, like, <laughs> but, you know, that's just the grind. Like, grind don't stop, the work don't stop. This is my update so far. Uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit that notification button. I promise y'all, this is not going to be the last video I'm posting. I'm trying to stay, stay and stick to um, tongue -tongue -tongue -tongue. I want to be more consistent, so I'm trying my best. Bear with me. I'm trying once every week. Once I start getting the tempo right, I'll pick it up. But like I said again, uh, make sure you like, comment, subscribe. Hit that notification, please. I promise you, I'm going to try to stay consistent. Real life with Earl, this is my update.